going to do a quick walk around here of the well the wings and the remainder of the project what I still have to do uh, I guess we could start here at this end I have some shaping to do before I can cover and give you an idea of how close I need to get with the leading edges I need to do that for about a hundred feet by hand so the tips are about there they're closest but the main wing panels are going to need some some time, some love. So that's next. Uh, there gets a, it, it will get a foam cap that actually goes over the rib here, and foam sheeting. That's oh geez, it's uh, that hobby board that weighs n next to nothing once you pull the the thick paper backing off both sides, and uh, it, it'll go over the top of the the leading edge back over to the top of the spar here, and a cap will continue on the, the top of that. The body will be covered in the same paneling actually since it weighs next to nothing and I'll be able to have a stressed skin foam body that you can tap tap on and uh, um, it'll hold its form. It'll hold the form I want with not not a lot of weight added. Uh, you can you can prime it, paint it, or uh, cover it with mylar. The wings will get covered in mylar. I'm gonna go with the chrome 2 mil with red tips. You can see here I have some of the rigging in place, the lower wing, the inboard panels. The rest of the lower wing can be hung, it's just in the way. Here you see what I'm really working on right now is carving and shaping both sides of this this um, saddle, if you will, or backrest for our shoulder rests. It, it's all working as one unit really, but but it's going to have more contour to it and then once both sides match, I can glue them on. And this is what I've been doing recently is permanently gluing this foam. This foam is all actually finally in place. It was only t taped. See, this is where I need to continue on, but the rest is in place. This is all permanent down here as well. The shape of the plane. I need some sanding and that paneling I go over. You can see uh, I had to carve this out for the rigging to work. Um, and it'll continue upward on the next panel. Uh, the door jam will be this foam that's added here. And a door will actually fit right on that, that lip, that that angled seal there. But I'm going to shape the seal better and then build the door in place. Same thing goes with windows up here. They'll come out. This foam piece down here is the actual side right down there. So it'll go in place like this. Once, once, once I start moving forward. And then this is a pattern for more foam to go in place with that body foam and I'll have plastic along this line actually and that'll be part of the actual cockpit window the translucent window which I have plastic over there on the motorcycle ready for that there's the other side, the other cheek if you want to call it the sides all in place and that's permanent down there except for the seat as I was saying I'm working on that right now just start going together rather quickly, but you can see the detail. It's all built in. And you'll be able to lay quite comfortably for a long, long time. So, she's much closer. So, the leading edge is going to take time. Getting that body on there took a little bit of time. But after that, it's the drive system, system and uh, uh, control linkage, covering. Uh, I'll probably be getting some help with that. So, looking good. Getting closer.